Haven and welcome to my channel. So for my first video I wanted to do on YouTube since I'm new here and hello and welcome to my channel. I wanted to do things to do when you're bored since the coronavirus is everywhere technically. So you're probably at home cooped up in your room or in your house with your family and mostly you're probably in your room. You're probably watching Netflix, YouTube and TikToks mostly and also looking on Snapchat, Instagram and maybe Pinterest. But okay because we're gonna do something that will probably change your life since you have a long time since school is out unless you live somewhere where you still have school which sucks for you but if you're like me and you don't have school you need to start something new you maybe need to start like reading more maybe learning more maybe getting ahead of school eating healthier doing workouts or something you need to do something new so i'm going to give you 10 things that i really really recommend to do when you have this much time so let's go get into the video my number one tip is to read yes read you're gonna have to turn off that phone get off all your social medias and just turn it off so you could get some alone time of reading do it oh my gosh you're taking too long so yes my number one thing is to read you can become actually smarter if you read more yes you can it's true it's facts so stop making those faces if you make those faces i'm just gonna ignore you so i know you probably hate reading mm -hmm, you do so just get some time to just take some in you could read the bible you could read poems you could read regular books right now i'm reading the dog's purpose and i actually read a lot in this book i had to get some time off my phone i just turned it off and made sure it was away from me as possible from going on social medias or anything. So you can lock your phone in a room or something, but it's just up to you. Just get some time away from your phone. I actually enjoy reading, but for those who don't, it actually expands your vocab. A few moments later. Second option is to learn TikTok dances or do TikTok dances. It's a good exercise. It's technically a free class when you have the coronavirus out. You could create some or you could just copy some or add a little spice up to it. Even post them. Get creative and don't be shy to do it. Third option is to do journaling. Get tags, get receipts, get books that you don't use, rip pages out, cut out photos from magazines, save ribbons, stickers, anything you want and put it into a journal. You could also write with gel pens and everything. Get old photos, put them in a journal and be creative with it. This journal is really helpful to release your stress and it's really helpful fourth option is to work out my fifth option is to get cozy with a blanket and to write a story i know this might sound like really boring but trust me this will help you with your muscle memory for writing and also it's a good exercise for your wrist and hand it's also stress relieving and you're really becoming creative and also imagining Sixth option is to organize your room. Put up all the stuff that's around your room to keep it nice and organized. Seventh option is to go through your phone, delete all apps you don't want or photos and to organize your apps or posts. Eighth option is to eat healthy. Instead of eating fast food or junk food all day, eat something healthy, such like vegetables, fruits. Yes, you're gonna go on a diet. You have to. Okay, move all that junk food aside and get some fresh cut fruit, such like watermelon. It's nice and sweet, and also peach. They're really tasty and sweet. Any vegetable or fruit will do. Ninth option is to FaceTime your friends. Since we have to be social distancing during the coronavirus, this is a good time to FaceTime your friends and talk. I know this might be a simple little thing to do, but it's actually really fun to FaceTime your friends. Tenth option is to do schoolwork or assignments or study for school. Just get ahead of school or you have to do stuff for school.
enjoyed this video, then please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to turn on that notification bell so every time I post a new video, you can be notified. And also don't forget to follow me by my social medias down here. And well, yeah, bye. Also don't forget to wash your hands and be safe.